I have the Samsung Galaxy S23 and I'll be showing you how to use the voice recorder on this phone. So the voice recorder comes pre-installed on your Galaxy S23 and normally you'd find it in the Samsung folder in the app drawer. So if you tap on that, you should see the voice recorder there. If for some reason it's not there, then you might want to look for it by typing voice recorder and you should find it somewhere and then you can launch it from there. Now, this is a home page of the screen recorder. Let's go to standard. That's what it should look like when you first launch a screen recorder. Now, by default in the standard mode, it basically records all the sounds around you using the microphones on the phone itself. So it can record ambient sounds. It can record, uh, it can record you speak. It can record the radio. It can record so many things and all you have to do is tap on the record button give it necessary permissions and currently it's recording everything i'm saying and all the ambient sounds around me you can pause the recording by tapping on pause and when you're ready to continue simply tap on that and it's going to continue recording your voice now you can actually see a sort of a wave here depending on how loud or how uh, low you are in your voice. And when you're done recording, simply tap on the stop button. Now, as soon as you tap on stop, it's gonna give you the option to uh, save the recording. Now, you might want to record uh, the, you might want to rename your recording. So I'll, I'll call mine test one. And if you have categories for uh, recordings, you can, set, you can put it in a specific category or you can create a category here. Now I'll just leave it to none, which is no category at all, and then tap on save. And that voice recording is going to be saved. Now you can always go back to saved recordings by going to list and you should find a list of all the recordings there. And you can tap on any recording and listen to it. You can pause, you can push forward for three seconds. You can push backwards for about three seconds, like that. You can increase the speed of the recording, or rather, of the playback. So there's so many things you can do with this uh, screen recorder. You can also play it on repeat if you want to. Now, if I could just go back to the main screen recorder page, you have more options. So you have the interview option, and this is basically uh, good for recording interviews. So the phone will automatically uh, separate this, the microphones. Maybe the microphones on one side of the phone will record one person in the interview, and the microphone on the other side of the phone will record the other voice in the interview. So the, vo the phone is able to do that through, of course, artificial intelligence. So that's, uh, if you want to record an interview, that's the option you go for. And then also, you also have speech to text, which will basically uh, record your voice and everything you're saying, and also convert what you're saying into text, okay? Now, it's currently using English from the UK, but if you want to change the language, you can tap on that and choose a different language, okay? So let's try this. So. It's gonna start recording and basically transcribing whatever you're saying into text as it records. So speech to text, you need to agree to that. And as soon as you start, or as soon as you select that, it's going to start recording your voice and also transcribing everything you're saying into text. And then when you're done, you can tap on done. And let's save that as a memo, okay? So when you go back here, You can actually hear uh, everything you are saying and also you can see the transcription there let me just increase the volume and then when you're done you can tap on done let me just go back so you can listen in again and as soon as you start or as soon as you select that it's going to start recording your voice and also transcribing everything you're saying into text 
So that's basically how to uh, record voices and also convert uh, speech to text. Now, obviously, you also have the option to edit these uh, voice recordings. You can tap on this pen icon and you can crop the screen recordings the way you want. You can cut. Uh, let's uh, delete uh, dimmed area, delete selected area, delete dim area. You can select how to, which areas to delete. You can go ahead and 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 crop and edit these voice recordings and, this, and then save. Okay. So that's basically how to use the screen recorder on your Galaxy S23. If you go to the list, you can actually uh, touch and hold any recording. You have the option to move it to a different location, to rename it, to share, to delete. And if you tap on more, you also have the option to add to favorites and also move to the secure folder. That's basically how to use the screen recorder on your Samsung Galaxy S23. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like and maybe subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one.